The PDF Importer Pro version has the ability to convert PDF to Quark native objects, which then can be each edited separately. Okay, so I have the PDF Importer Pro extension installed and this new empty project. Let's pretend for the sake of the demonstration that I have exported this PDF earlier and that it was ready to be published, but now I realize that I've made some spelling mistakes. I would normally get back to my QXP file and edit the text here, but it may happen that you have deleted the project and you can't retrieve it. This case scenario is not such a big deal if you're on the PDF Importer Pro. So let's just open the Flout PDF inside our project. And I'm going to use, again, the import PDF function from the file menu and select my PDF. And on the bottom section, as you can see, there is this little text box which says convert to native object. And if ticked, it will convert the PDF to Quark Express native objects. That's what we want to do. So I click open and I let this ticked. And boom, I now have access to all these sections, whether they are image contents or text boxes. Now I can amend the text I want. For instance, Hamilton wants softer tires and more, not more fun, but more fans. Then I just have to export it again as a PDF. So this is our former PDF and this is our new one with the new title.